we were learning today that a person, halacha, in the in the Yaku Yosef he was mentioned, mentioned, that a person should always say, first of all, it's brought down the halacha also, a person should always say like a small prayer before he leaves the house when he touches the mezuzah. Please Hashem, you know, shmort seti ube'i. Say, uh, protect me from leaving and coming. And this is a very, very important uh, uh, um, idea in life. A person must understand that you think that you can walk out of one room to the next room. It's like walking here from there. You should just know you need Hashem for every single thing in your life. And I'm going to prove it to you right now, by the way, scientifically and, and, and through everything. Look, Havetz Chaim used to pray. He used to say something. Hashem, please, he's walking from one room to the next room. Hashem, please, say, help me walk from this room to the next room. What's going on? You need Hashem to walk. You need Hashem to talk. You need Hashem to move. You need Hashem for every single item that you do. And now I'll prove to you scientifically, medically, and all this. And I'll tell you a story that I, I witnessed this story myself. One day, we were all sitting down, a few of the boys, and we told one of our friends, we said, uh, let's go, we're washing the Tilayadain, we're making the Seuda, let's go. And he's by the sink. Do the Tilayadain. A normal God, a regular God. Do the Tilayadain. Standing like this. Hello, Jack, Yalla, hey. Not going. Guy's not going. Guy's not going. We didn't understand. One of my friends pushed him to the Nitilayadayim. One of my friends lifted his hand. The other one lifted his hand. And they did it like They sat down. We went afterwards, took him to a doctor. And they, we didn't understand because the thing was awkward. You can't wash the Nitilayadayim. It didn't make sense. You buy the sink. Go. Doctor explained to us, there's a bunch of billions of neurons in your brain. And if one neuron in your brain doesn't connect with the other, with the other neuron in your brain to, to, uh, uh, to go do a task that you're supposed to go, it'll never be. It, it, it doesn't connect. So the person hears that the liar dying. And he's by the sink. But he needs another neuron to connect that to actually go and do it. So without that, it doesn't connect. Now there's medication for that. That a person takes a medication and now the neuron connects with your neuron and that neuron. But what is it trying to teach you? You cannot move without Hashem. You think you go lift your hand up, move your arm, you walk, I'm walking, I'm talking, I'm hacking, I'm learning, I'm this, I'm that. You can't do nothing without Hashem. Zero, zero. Hashem has to give you the koach to see, to eat, to, even when you're eating. Well, what kind of business do you eat and you get full? Who, who said that should be? Hashem gave you that power. You eat, Hashem's doing that. No, you think it's the bread. No, because I ate bread, I ate a, I have a deep meal. No, I had the steaks, I have a lot of energy now because I ate the steak. What do you think, Rabbi? Hashem gave you that energy. And you have to believe that 100%. No, Rabbi, I'm a millionaire. Why? I know how to talk. You know, I had to connect over here, connect over there. I got him like this. I got him like that. You think. You think. You're off. Because the second you think it's you, you're in the, big, you're in the worst trouble. Because Hashem says, you think it's you? My koach, Rabbi, my koach. You have no koach. Zero. Hashem has to give you that koach. What's the, one of the first benachot we make every single morning? Baruch atah Hashem, Elokeinu melech haolam, hanoten la ya'ef koach. He gives you koach. You understand? And that being said, make sure you pray for everything. Like it says, hachef picha v'amal, ehu! Open up your mouth and I'll fill it. Just ask and ask and ask and talk to Hashem and talk to Hashem and ask Him for this, ask Him for that, ask Him for that. And we need Hashem's to give us every second of the day the power to live, the power to breathe, the power to talk, the power to decide. And this is what you have to understand. Hashem is giving us the Koach 24-7.